Today's Five Things You Need to Know is brought to you by Power Credit Union, proudly serving Southern Colorado. Hi there, I'm Elizabeth Watts with your News 5 update. And we've obtained a court document concerning the criminal case against Cleet Keller. He's the former U.S. Olympic swimmer charged in the U.S. Capitol riots. According to the document, a judge has ordered him to surrender his passport, stay in Colorado, and not to drink excessively. Prosecutors say he was caught on camera during the insurrection wearing his Team USA jacket. He is facing several federal charges tonight. A grass fire that threatened homes on the west side of the springs has been contained. It burned about five acres near the intersection of 30th and Water Streets. Five homes were threatened. Three had to be evacuated. Those who were evacuated have been allowed to go home. Now to the pandemic, the state health department reporting more than 1300 new cases in the past 24 hours out of 6200 people tested. A little over 200 more people have been admitted to hospitals in our state with COVID and sadly 77 more people have died as a direct result of the virus. And the pandemic has challenged our school system like no other. Today, one Springs educator recognized Mark Carlson, the Dean of Students at Banning Lewis Ranch, received the Essential Worker Award for his efforts to keep students and staff safe in the classroom. Carlson credits the school's success to his colleagues going above and beyond during these unprecedented times. Here's Mike. Thanks, Elizabeth. That downslope flow is active today. That's compressional heating. These temperatures would be normal in April, not January. Pueblo 63 degrees. Average this time of year is 47 in Colorado Springs. We topped out at 59, 16 degrees warmer than average. I say enjoy it while you can. Big changes on the way. Here's what happens Sunday. A backdoor cold front rolls in. We'll have a moist upslope flow at the surface. Snow Snow in your forecast and it is going to be a lot colder highs by Sunday, more than 20 degrees colder than Saturday. Thank you for listening to today's five things you need to know sponsored by Power Credit Union.